And welcome back to the channel guys, Gvids here. If you guys are new around here, uh, make sure you do subscribe to the channel so you never miss out on any future content. And today I just wanted to make up another mashed up video of all the newer locations that we have found so far. I've been having some requests for this. I do have a playlist made out with all the single videos made out in it already. Um, none of these are like um, brand spanking new. These are all have single videos already, but I have been requested to mash them up into one single video uh, like I did with the other seven locations so this one has I think four locations this one here um, has the least amount of items but it has a lot of other little goodies here um, but what we're gonna want to do is stand in the middle here just like me and then we're gonna press start go down to online and then we're gonna go to free roam now what we're doing is for spawning in all the collectibles from all the day cycles in at once so we can simply just run around and collect them all now I'm going to skip out that first step um, once we go to all the other locations. Just keep that in mind that you do need to repeat that at each location that you go to. We can only do this once every 24 hours real time. Um, there are a lot of locations so you can hit up all 10 or 11 whatever they are um, once every single day which usually takes roughly just over an hour. Um, those are all the little goodies there, cigars and some ammo and some other um, edibles kind of thing. But uh, we're not here for those. We're just going to grab the tarot card that's right here. Um, but uh, this spot here only has four items. But uh, the cigars and stuff, if you're not filled up on them already, are definitely worth grabbing as well. Because they definitely help out your dead eye. And let's go ahead and grab this one here. Um, good idea guys is to have a moonshine running or a trader run in the background of this as well so you're uh, continuously making money um, at on all your rolls so to speak and that's the last card for this location now let's bounce off to the next one here Ooh, sweet I think that's my uh, daily my daily activity ward there we go anyways now we're on to the next location here um, unfortunately, a few items didn't actually spawn for me, so hopefully they spawn in for you. Um, there has been some reports of things just not showing up. I couldn't really tell you why. Either we've grabbed them in the last 24 hours, or maybe it has something to do with us being filled up on the sets. I'm really not too sure, but uh, it's still worth doing. Just sometimes we might lose out on a few items on the locations, but let's start off with this one here. Once you've pressed started and doing your um, server hop, so to speak, you're going to come back to this location and start off at the table there. Then we're going to work our way into this house. I actually did forget something in this house last time, so I will add that in. Thank you for my commenters there that uh, let me know that I missed that one. Uh, so this one here is a pain in the ass to grab. Once you get it, it's underneath the bed there. And then the one I missed is right here. Which is silly, because I was like literally right beside it, grabbing the alcohol bottle, which is in here. But unfortunately today, it was not there for me. Which got me a little kabobulated. I was thinking, because I'm trying to do this all of memory. Um, if anyone knows me, my memory is not the best. Uh, so once I walk into these buildings, I'm trying to like force myself to remember where the hell everything is. Especially so I don't look like I'm a retard walking around the buildings in circles. Um, but that alcohol bottle was not there and it completely combobulated me, so I'm just checking to make sure I uh, just didn't look in the wrong place. But no, that's where the alcohol bottle is and it's definitely not there for me today. Um, but not to say it won't be there for you guys, um, but just keep that in mind. Sometimes things just don't show up, but that's no big deal. There's two other items at this location. Hopefully they're there for us. The next one will be... Er, whoopsie daisies. Uh, we're going to go right up here in the stairs. Uh, okay, not up the stairs. We're going to go the hard way, of course. And it's right here on the mantle or the railing, whatever you want to call it. That kind of sucks. My bottle's not there, but that's all right. There's another tarot card, and that's not freaking here either, eh? Son of a gun. But that's all right. Uh, just keep that in mind, guys. Sometimes they won't be there. I can't fully say why. Um... Now maybe I've grabbed that card somewhere else in the last 24 hours, so it's just not showing up at this location. Um, that could possibly be it. But anyways, let's move on to the next location here. And uh, I just fast traveled to um, Emerald Station when I got here. Easiest way, from right here to there. And then we, of course, done our press start, going down to online, and done all that fun stuff. And now we ran back to the location, and we're going to pick up our items again. 
yellow. Hopefully I don't forget any items at this location. The last time I also had to cut something in. Um, that's all right though, as long as we get them in the video, that's all that really matters. So you guys can at least find out where they are. So the first one here is just inside the bench, or on the bench, whatever you want to call it. I always seem like I'm forgetting something. Um, if I do forget something, guys, please let me know. Um, there could be always a little sneaker bottle somewhere that I forget to look because I'm trying to go off of memory, but I'm pretty sure there was no bottles here. And they're just the two items within here. And then uh, we'll have our surprise item possibly, depending on what day cycle it is, because it's diggable, so it's not force spawnable. But there is a diggable around here, so I'll show you that, guys, now. Once we make it out of the house here, we just whip out the old um, metal detector and run by this uh, scarecrow to see if we get any vibrations, and we are not, so nothing is there for us right now. And then we're just going to continue our way into this barn, which, again, my card is not freaking there. Son of a gun. Well, there should be a card here as well. Um, that's a few items that's been missing. I'll pick that up since we're here. That's kind of shitty, guys. Unfortunately, I don't know why they're not coming in for us all the time. Um, but I guess we're still it's still worth doing, even if a few items are missing from the locations. Um, and then the next location here is just actually above where we were. You can either use a fast travel, come right here, or we're just right at this location here, which was simply just a nice little run up the street. And then we've already pressed started and done our thing, so we're going to go and start our collecting. Now this location, I actually did forget something at the end of it again. So I uh, did cut it back in for you guys there, so just don't mind the little choppiness once that comes up. Um, but there is another collectible that I missed within the house here, just in the other room. Again, when I walk into these things, it's like my brain goes empty. I'm trying to, I'm like, okay, let's not screw this up now. I'm trying to make a video. Um, and, of course, I always seem to forget something. But that's all right. No big deal. At least I find it after I cut, uh, make the recording, so I can always cut it back in. That's the important part. So, anyways, uh, we're going to leave that house. We will be going back in there just a bit later. I just wanted to keep um, the flow at least somewhat smooth. So, we're going to run back outside and go up to the little porta potty thing here. <clears throat> and I just got disconnected. Super duper. And is this card not here either? Son of a bitch. Oh, no, I think I'm just standing on it. Yeah, we're just standing on it. Good stuff. <laughs> I don't want to see more stuff not showing up for me. That's never a fun thing. But uh, as long as uh, I'm going to whip out the old metal detector. See, sometimes when I see water towers, I always like to check. You can always whip out the collector's map and see if there's anything around the area as well for diggables and flower-wise. Because we cannot force spawn those in, but sometimes we get lucky and they are around the area anyways. Uh, so we're going to grab this card here, and again, this is where I would have ended my video like last time, um, but I forgot the hairbrush inside the little room, so we're going to go and cut to that right now, uh, so you guys can see where that one is. I do apologize for that, so this is where we are here, I'm going to show you exactly, um, I'm going to come out of the room here. So this is where we were, just off that little mantle was the tear card, and then the one in the chimney there, so then we're going to come to this room here. And I'll just be inside of this chest. I do apologize for that. Uh, I always seem to forget something. I don't know why. Um, but anyways, those are all the locations, the brand new ones that have been added. Uh, do check the playlist, guys, but I did want to make a mashed up video because I had been requested for that. Um, but anyways, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I know it's a little bit long again, so I thank anyone who's uh, stuck it out. Um, I appreciate it, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.